The survivor of a deadly wreck in Green Bay will likely not be charged in connection to that crash. However, police say charges may be recommended for her role in an altercation at a bar that happened just minutes earlier, two nights ago. The incident began at Lucky 7 Bar on South Broadway. Minutes later, Green Bay police say a car she was in broadsided another vehicle near the intersection of Ashland and Clinton. The drivers of both vehicles died at the scene. Lou Hillman has more in this Fox 11 follow-up. Police say 25-year-old Stacy LaBeouf continues to recover at an area hospital after walking away from this wreck on Wednesday. Claim the life of her boyfriend James Clark and another driver, 25-year-old Mindy Dickinson. According to police, LaBeouf was in the car with Clark when he broadsided Dickinson's vehicle. Dickinson was on her cell phone at the time talking with her son's father. When he heard a scream and the call was lost. Investigators say speed and alcohol were both contributing factors in the crash. Uh, we have witnesses that have told us in their estimation the vehicle is going in upwards of 80 miles per hour and that's all. Uh, the, the area that the crash happened was is 25 miles per hour. Police say Clark and LaBeouf were kicked out of this Broadway bar just minutes earlier. Witnesses told police they came in visibly intoxicated and started an altercation. Investigators believe the couple had been at several other bars before then. Fox 11 has learned LaBeouf works at a bar less than a mile from Lucky 7's. Police are not saying if that's one of the places the couple had been drinking. Like I say, there's several other taverns that may be involved in this whole night that, that these people were out. And, and we'll certainly try to get as much information as possible. Investigators say they're still considering whether any charges will be recommended for the altercation at Lucky 7's. But we'll, we'll definitely look at all the facts and make a, appropriate decisions at that time. Now, police say Stacy LaBeouf's injuries are not serious. We did try to contact her for the story, but our messages were not returned. Police say they hope to know more about the crash when they have both the toxicology and accident reconstruction reports back, but that could take at least another week.